birdhouse. It's springtime. Pickle and Brush are in the park together with their grandpa. All three of them enjoying the sun. <laughs> it's gonna be the new world record. Hang up. <laughs> Watch me, Bagel. Hop. Oh, look at those funny little birds. Those birds are called starlings. And they are finally here. Finally? Where they been? They leave for warmer climes every fall. And then come back in spring. And why do they come back? They come back to lay eggs. I know. That's why they make those bird houses. That's right, Brush. Sometimes they put them on fruit trees because they ate dangerous insects. <laughs> hey, let's make one ourselves. Yay, let's do it. Woof, woof, hey. Probably dead. Just be careful and watch your fingers. Hey, Daddy, we just built a birdhouse with Gran. Really? We used to build one with my Gran back in the days. Do you know where you want to hang it? We'll hang it on some tree. Does it matter? Of course it matters. You should put it high enough so that birds don't get disturbed by passers-by. I think we should hang it in the park somewhere. Yay! Birdies gonna love it there. They'll have a company. But, uh, who can get up so high? Don't mind if I do. I remember well how I used to climb trees when I was little. Hooray! We're making a birdhouse! <laughs> this is so cool! Now a whole family of birds can have a housewarming party! I think this tree is just what we need. I think the birds are gonna like it here. It's cozy. Yes. And it's easy to reach. So that's good. Well, this branch looks proper. But how do we hang it? Whoops, I don't know. Oh no, birdies are gonna come any minute now. We need to tie it up to the tree very carefully. Oh, they are so cute. Dad, the birds are here already. Hurry up. Okay. Here comes nothing. this program to bring you the weather report. Get ready, folks. Looks like it's sizzling hot today. Yummy! Who's weather report? It's your granddad's favorite band, Sonny Boy. All right, puppies. Are you ready for a little trip? I'm ready. Don't forget your hat. You don't want your hats big, do you? I don't want to wear a hat. You can always take it off. I can hit you, Grandpa. <laughs> Bye, Gran. Bye, Thanks Granny. Thanks for the pancakes. It was so delicious. Yummy, yummy. Woof, woof. Hey. Lovely day. day. <laughs> hey, wait for me. Oh, I think the weather report was right. Phew. So hot. I'm tired. Yes, it is very hot. Well, how about some ice cream? Ice cream, yay! 
Thank you. You're welcome, kids. Oh no, it's dripping! Oh. How about we get cool at the fountain? Let's go! Wow! Is it broken? No, Tassel. It just dried up because of the heat. Hot. Gwen, do something. Pretty please. Don't worry. I know a place we can go. Come on, catch up. Blur, blur, blur. Weather report. My foot. The winter is here. Oh, oh boy. I didn't know the year of during summer. How unusual. We have so many customers today. Don't you stand there, guys. Hurry up and come on in. <laughs> Gran, you're the best! Yeah! Great idea, Gran! I feel fresh and breezy! I love ice skating, especially in midsummer! <laughs> Wonderful! Hey! Yeah. How lovely! <laughs> How we go? Hey, nice job, Grandpa! Yeah, doing great! And so, together with Grandpa, home not alone. Today is a special day for Wolf Wolves. Mom and Dad go to see the play with Mom's music in it. Pickle and Brush will stay at home with Grandpa and Grandma. This is going to be one fine evening. Pickle, Brush, me and Dad go to see a play tonight. And you'll stay with Grandpa and Grandma. Wait! Will Grandpa tell us a bedtime story? Of course. And will you kiss us goodnight? I'll kiss you when you're asleep. Why can't we see that play? Because you can only see plays for kids. We do it some other time. This play is for grown-ups only. By the way, Grandpa and Grandma will get you fresh milk oh. so you can make yourselves honey milkshakes. <laughs> That's so cool. We'll make you some too. <laughs> woof, woof, hey. Lovely. Put the milk in the cooler deck. And Clodo pleat firmly. And what about honey? Should we take it? Don't worry, Granny. Let's get going. We can't be late. There's little gas left in the car, so we'll get some on the way. I never understood those ties. So many shapes, so many forms. How am I supposed to pick the right one? Come on, Dad. Mom always said that fashion repeats itself. Just pick whichever you like most. Whoa, this one looks like my beard. <laughs> and this one looks like my ribbons. Whoa, hold on, Dad. There is a butterfly on your neck. I'll go get a scoop. <laughs> Don't worry. Phone go anywhere. It's not a real butterfly. It's a kind of tie. Equals Pautau. <laughs> yes. Hello. Oh dear. Yes. Yes, yeah, sure. I'll be right away. Kids, they'll stay here alone for a while. Not a problem. Okay, I'll be in a jiffy. Hey, what happened? Grandpa ran out of gas. They got stuck. And now we can go to the theater. I have to drive up to get them some gasoline. Dad, and what about us? Good question. Can you guys stay here alone for half an hour? Of course we can. I'll be right back. Don't worry, Dad. We'll be here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, mommy. No way. This is a bad idea. Should we go all together? Good thinking, Bagel. Hop on in. Hooray! Hello, Granny. Oh. <laughs> Hello, Grandpa. Thank God you're here. 
I was worried the milk would go. Hello! We missed you so much! My fault! Should be more careful next time. <laughs> That's fine. Okay. Ready, Freddy's? And that would be the best. Oh, it was really easy night. Good thing you were right on time for the play. Oh, yes. How was the play? It was great. Mommy's song was a hit. <laughs> and our daddy looked gorgeous in his bow tie. How were the kids? Were they nice? They were great! We had fun and then they went to sleep right away. It was a wonderful eve. Oh yes, you don't get bored around the woof-woofs, you don't. Lovely day!